Hi, welcome back to Reading Scenario Series. So, um, this far we've been able to um, add products, been able to save our products with tags and um, follow our data schema that we, that, we, that we sketched earlier to store our data in um, the Redis database. So, um, let's continue and then um, display the products that we just added and then add more products. So right now, this works, we have been sure of that. Tags. And something tells me. Says you put in tags will work. And let's go. All right, browse. So let's see. My internet is just a little bit slow, so it's taking time to load the image. Let's leave. Let me share when connected. Let's Um, give me a moment so I can post I'll pause this video then um, fix my internet. I'll be right back. That's for that. So I think my internet is back now. Um here it is. So um let's let's add more, let's add more. So um there is um sleepless jumpsuits, jumpsuits, and jumpsuits. Press pass not defined. Oh no font. Where is that coming from? Product controller. Go to the browser my phone, so what do I have? Go to the hall. What's with me and this browse? Should I say this one? That has been created, so pencil skirts, so pencil skirts. What? Front control line 28. I already played your own part. Spiral of all Christ. Okay. Main sandal, sandal. That's tag. What is wrong? Close the whole lot. Put dots the whole. Return. Well, yes, for that again. What is wrong? Last one. This. Sure. This is just supposed to add the products and redirect to the products list page. Yes. So these are the products. They are all here. Yeah, loaded. Right. So um, the last thing we want to do here is um, once you click on um, each tag, see. Once you once you click on each tag, I want to be able to like filter by the tag. So this is how that is possible. You know, um, for each tags. Tags, tag, the ID is just like the string name tag. We saved all the products for each tag right there. So for instance, let me go here. Okay. We will check for tag men. I know we have a um, lot of things having men. Tag is what's list. Uh, so let's one, let's one. See, yeah, we have we have three products that has a tag. Men, same thing for women. Men, yeah, we have we have more products for for the tag women. So 
that's that's the answer to what we want to do. So um under view products, we're just going to check. Request. Request. Let's check if request has tag else. So products would be just products by tag request gets tag so static function gets product by tag tag So here we have um, this again. Let's copy this here. Now instead of Z range, we are having um, L range because we're getting from the list. Right. Tag. Tags. Tag. Do not need this. It's a list, not a lot of sets, so it's not going to return in a particular order. So look through the product ID. Do not score. What are you ID? This. So let's see. Let's see what gets. So if I check for men. Oh, yeah. I'm sure someone picked that up. I'm sure one of the viewers picked that up. So zero minus one here. Yeah. Like I said again, if um, we need to do pagination, we could actually just pass that today. So this is good for pagination. So let's see. So it's giving us so. Let's see how we store the tags so we know. Our product tags. Oh, yeah, we made a mistake here. We're supposed to, you know, the key is supposed to be like this tags and then the ID. But now that we made a mistake, we we'll just go with this. Well, you can make a correction from your hand. I'll just go with this. To return something, yeah. So this is it. And then, foot we will just return one. We have then women, we have for women, pants, we have one pants, jumpsuits, skirts. That's just what's what's in this stuff. So, um, I'll give you as a challenge to um, do this when you click on the products, view the products, and under the products, show related products. Now, one thing I'm going to give you is related products are going to, are going to be products that share the same tags with um, other products. So, for example, if I click on women, if I click on pencil, right, um, pencil, skirts, or if I click on jumpsuits, it's going to show related products that, have, that share the same tag with it. So, that's, um, that's something that's an assignment for you. Um, you, can, you, can, you can drop if you have any question, you can drop a question in your comments, and then once you do it, you can just share share with me how you, how you achieved it or share it in the comment section. Don't be bad, or you can do that when you head to my blog. My blog is oluafemialofe.com, right? That's where this um, blog post is, so you can view. So um, next, what we're we'll doing is um, we have been able to you know install this show installation option, discuss the other types 
pretty simple e-commerce really is our story we've done that now the last thing we'll be doing i'm um, discussing is using another web socket to really skew show live updates so when a new product is added to just show without the user not having to refresh the page we're going to, we're going to do that so until then please subscribe to my video so as to get updates when the video is out thanks for watching